Hello. Today I'm going to talk about the resistance that we might have if we are being guided into transitioning into something new, yet we don't know what that looks like yet. And the ego, the mind comes in and says, yes, but I need to know what it looks like, how it's going to play out. I must know, I must do, 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 do to figure all that out. So the suggestion coming in today is to just be, to rest in being so that you can be in that stillness, in that quietness. And I'm going to do a sound healing with the drum and rattling and the toning to help us, and this is me included, to rest in the knowing that the that spirit has our back, the universe has our back, and we are being guided as long as we open up and allow that to unfold for us. So I feel like for me right now, I am, I have just tilled the earth and like springtime and I fertilized it and I've planted my seeds, I've rakeyed the seeds and I've put them in the ground and now I just, I have to wait. I have to wait, right? Your things don't don't sprout overnight. Uh, and so it's this time of just being patient and being, having time to meditate, be out in nature, and being in that stillness so that we can get the clarity and the messages from spirit, from the universe of what our next step is supposed to be. So there can be a lot of resistance with that, right? The ego's in fear, the ego needs to know, there's all sorts of things, your paradigm that you've always had is different now, it's breaking down, and you're, you're creating a new one, but again, you don't know exactly what it looks like. So I was guided today to do a sound healing for us, and again, this includes me, um, to help us release the fear, release the resistance, of I must know right now, I must know what this new picture is going to look like, this new paradigm, this new reality for me, okay? So I'm going to do some drumming, some rattling possibly, and some toning. And again, it's all sound healing. So go ahead, I'm going to grab my drum, go ahead and get comfortable. Just go ahead and sit down somewhere. And just go close your eyes and go into your heart space and put a put a grounding cord on so like uh, imagine a tube of energy as wide as your hips hollow it can be made out of whatever you like a rainbow a tree trunk a waterfall and just really connect into mother earth connect into her supportive loving energy and this is where you can release any energy that is just not serving you at this moment. Any of that fear, the angst of, oh God, I don't know. So go ahead and just close your eyes. Take a couple deep breaths. Just really feel into that, that root chakra, releasing any, any of the angst if this is resonating for you. And I'm going to do a little bit of a, a sound healing for us to help us be instead of do, 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 no, we're going to just be. Crumbling. 
and let the sound, the toning that is just channeled in to help us break up that resistance and let us really just be in that heart space trusting this is a big piece of trust trusting the universe has our back the ego comes in and says no no but no can't do that and we say yes oh you 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 oh you your hands on your heart. And they're guiding us to say, I trust myself. something that really resonates for you and it doesn't matter what it is it can be 
small as having your cup of tea looking outside into your garden. It doesn't, it doesn't matter. There's no right or wrong. So finding what makes you have that sense of joy in your heart. Yeah. Particularly as we're going through this transition. So on that note, I wish you a beautiful rest of your day. And I'll see you soon.